everyone welcome back to my youtube channel wow it feels good to say that it has been a hot minute hasn't it uh yeah i do apologize that i haven't uploaded in a long time hopefully you've been following over on my instagram and you've kind of had a bit of an idea of what is going on uh, if not i will just very quickly fill you in because i have had a lot of people so amazingly supportive you guys messaging me asking where i've gone is everything okay and what's going on so this is obviously as you've seen from the title an irregular choice new care bears unboxing and i will get right to it but like i said i just want to do a very very brief quick little update just because you guys are so amazing and i don't just want to kind of upload a video and not talk about the fact that i haven't uploaded in so long or that i've been even really absent on my instagram as well like basically just social media in general i've gone a bit quiet so i did kind of update on my instagram that um in february i was offered a job in manchester and i was in the middle of moving to manchester when lockdown happened so we had sold our house and i was living with my little sister in manchester and matthew was going to follow me down to manchester and he was looking for a job and covid happened lockdown happened so i moved back from manchester into matthew's parents house where matthew was staying until he could join me in manchester and me and matthew are now living in matthew's parents house and we don't have our own home um, I'm working from their dining room. All of my stuff is in storage and we don't have anywhere in Manchester to live yet because we never managed to get a chance to find anywhere. So that's kind of what's been going on. We are literally just in limbo at the minute and I'm working full time now. Um, I absolutely adore my job, but it does take up all of my time. So yeah, I can't really upload anything on Instagram because I don't really have my own home, my own bits and pieces, my own clothes. Like I had to go and get this out of storage um, just to do this video. And I've come back to my old house because the new owner gets the keys in four days and I just really want to take advantage one last time of my garage walls. <laughs> and I've had to take days off work just to be able to do this video as well. So yeah, it's been really hard. I really just can't upload at the minute. Uh, YouTube, there's, there's nothing for me to, to upload. I'm not I don't have anything to talk about um i used to do like hauls and stuff i'm not really buying anything um i can't show you my disney collection it's in storage i can't show you my new home I, i'm not living anywhere at the minute and on instagram i can't really show daily pictures of my outfits because i'm working from home every day like really working from home and yeah hopefully that kind of gives you an idea like i am not going anywhere and it was going to be quieter anyway on my social media. I did say this when I was moving to Manchester, but COVID has just made it so much harder to upload. So hopefully once I get back to Manchester and when Matthew gets down with me, it will be a little bit easier when we're in our own place and I have all my things and yeah, hopefully that makes a bit of sense. Anyway, don't want to go on about that any longer. That's not what this video is about, but I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm just in a bit of limbo at the minute and I will get back to it and thank you so much for you all being so supportive and patient with me and yeah and also the wig is because my lockdown hair is disgusting is anybody else living that lockdown hair life like I'm letting my roots grow so I was like I can't I need to be purple and pink and pretty care bears kind of aesthetic so hello Malwig <laughs> so anyway to the video right I was contacted by a regular choice last oh i want to say october and they asked me if i wanted to be involved in a really cool project and i was like of course i want to be involved with your care bears project i worked with a regular choice before um unbelievably grateful for everything that comes my way as a blogger um especially considering i've been so quiet it's it's nice that they still wanted me to be involved so i've worked with them a little bit on their dumbo range that they released they sent me over some boots i'll put a little picture and they sent me over some toy story flats as well which was really nice i think that was the year before but this has to be my biggest collaboration with a regular choice and i even sent them a huge email just saying how amazing they were and so so kind to offer me this amount of stuff and i got to pick what i wanted like i'm not even joking they messaged me back when they were first getting everything together and they were like this is the collection what do you want it's, it was like a dream come true so i literally picked everything that i wanted from this care bears collection and it came to my house 
well, Matthew's parents' house, my partner, about three weeks ago. And I haven't opened it because I really just want to unbox this with you guys. True first impressions and just see it for what it is. And I'm just, I peeked inside to make sure everything was okay and nothing was like broken or anything. And wow, I am excited. So this has been like since last October and then since the last three weeks, I have been really restraining myself not to open it. I wanted to do it with you guys. You guys deserve that. You've been very patient. So here it is. A regular choice are releasing their Care Bears collection today at 12 o'clock. So when this video went up, hopefully, they have released an entire Care Bears collection. And honestly, I mean, you guys know that a regular choice, their stuff is just sublime. It's like none other. It's completely unique. This was gifted. Regardless of whether it's paid or not, I'm going to be completely truthful, but it's a regular choice. You know it's going to be amazing. So let's unbox this oh my god i'm so excited right so this box came to my house three weeks ago and i've been dying to open it oh whoa okay so let me just get the invoice out and get that out of the way right oh my god this makes me so happy this is exactly what i need right now some good old irregular choice like i've been missing shopping i've been missing my fun clothes i've been wearing makeup like once a month like i need this i need this right now and i'm sure there's a lot of you guys that are like ready with your cup of tea and just ready to get into this unboxing so get comfy because oh, this just looks amazing this is going to be a good one so that is what you can see when i open the box so i'm going to have to start with the bag i have to start with the bag you guys know that i love shoes bags clothes jewelry i love it all but irregular choice bags are just oh wow so i don't really have any of the irregular choice kind of big handbags that you could use every day for like going to work going to school going to college and when they asked me which bag i want i really wanted this one it looked big enough to really just use on a daily basis so let's get this bag out i'm excited oh my god this is like the best bag in the world oh my god this makes me so happy oh Right, let me get the plastic off. Oh, the detail, the detail. I should probably point out, I have shoes, tights, a bag, a kimono, and they are bringing out a jewelry range, but because of COVID, I believe they had some um, like difficulties. So I think that is being released at a later time. So I don't think I have the jewelry that I picked up, but still, I'm super grateful for what I do have. So, really upsettingly i don't even have my care bears to try and put in the background because they're in storage i have four care bears they're in storage gutted this is exactly what i need right now i'm okay it's just been very hard and i don't feel myself lately you guys some of you really might be able to relate lockdown has been hard i like to dress up and do my makeup and wear nice clothes and I haven't even been able to do that for Instagram because I don't have my clothes and just having something like this in my hand makes me feel like me. Does that make sense? Oh, I don't know. Oh wow, okay. Let's actually start talking about this bag and stop me just waffling on. So I've got the big irregular choice tag there. Very thick bad boy cardboard. Right, so we're gonna start with the front. Oh, he's even got his little button nose like the actual teddy bears do. Oh my God. So of course we have Chia Bear or Chair Bear. Chia Bear. Depends how you say it, but I say Chia Bear and it sounds weird. I know it's my accent. So Chia Bear on the front there. Um, he is fluffy. He is 3D. Oh, he's like, an, he's like the actual plushies. So he has the little button heart nose like the actual plushies do. He's fluffy, little embroidery. He's absolutely gorgeous. And then we've got the two little stars, 3D here at the sides. Wow, the detail and sparkly white iridescent clouds. And then this pattern here, I'm pretty sure I chose, I tried, there was two kind of main patterns that I could see throughout the collection. And I tried to choose the same kind of pattern on all of the items that I chose just to relate them together. So I'm pretty sure this pattern is on my kimono tights and a little bit on the shoes that I chose. Um, and then we've got pink iridescent double handles there. And then when you move around the side, we have a 3D fluffy little star again. 
and then there's obviously room for a another strap which must be inside and then a sequin can you see the sequin i'm sorry my camera is so bright because i'm in such a dark room but you can see the sequin there and then we have the traditional care bears pattern on the back there uh, so we've got sunshine bear and you know i'm not entirely sure who the green bear is but i have i have sunshine bear and plush um and then it's the same on that side with the green um the star and the sequins absolutely I mean, the detailing it is a double bag so two zips so we've got double zips and a middle compartment so i'm going to get that out oh, 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 oh. It's like a mermaid inside. Okay, look at the handle. Purple and green. Matches my hair. And then look inside. So do you see what I was saying about this bag being big enough for every day? But it has compartments. So it's got two zippy parts. And inside the zip, the detailing just goes on. So inside the zip, it's purple. And then there's another zip and there's the Irregular Choice Embroidery logo on there. And then on the other side, oh, okay, so you've got, it's pink again, and then you've got a pocket here and then a phone kind of pocket. Absolutely stunning. And my new everyday bag, I know you're probably thinking you should keep that and keep it nice. This bag needs to be shown off and I will wear it with pride and make sure that I really take care of it. There is the bag that I chose, absolutely in love with it. The pictures are all going all over my Instagram and stuff. I'm back, or at least I am while I have content. Um, but yeah, there's the bag. So don't want this video to be super long. So let's move on to the next item. This wig, honestly. Okay, so the next item. Yes, I was right. These are the tights. And the tights are the same pattern that was the pattern around the front of the handbag there. Um, so it says 85% poly polyamide and 15% spandex. Um, please take care of me, I am delicate. I have never had any of the irregular choice tights before not because i didn't want to but because i missed out on the ones i really wanted so i really wanted the toy story ones a while back um, i missed out on them i think they're great for when you go to the parks and things like the disney parks if you get the disney themed ones and i really wanted the sleeping beauty and maleficent tights and i missed out on them also though i don't know how much i trust myself with i think these retail for 27 pound i always ladder my tent tights but these are probably a lot better quality than the tights I buy. So I imagine they're a bit harder to ladder. So let's get them out. Oh, they're nice. Yeah, they are thicker. Okay, they're way thicker than the tights I usually buy and put ladders in. So that is the tights there. Like I said, I will put like proper pictures at the side of everything so that you can see everything on. And I'm going to put them on actually and see how they fit. I'm pretty sure they come in one size. I don't think they're sizing. I don't remember giving them my size tights one size so they must be pretty like stretchy but also like fitted um like a good quality material that's going to fit to everyone that is the waistband yeah it's pretty stretchy oh yeah definitely and they look like they're quite high waisted as well so super comfy so yeah oh, i'm excited to wear them oh, i am so excited for these right we're gonna do the shoes because i can't leave it any longer oh, the box is just amazing so we have grumpy bear i think the blue bear is definitely grumpy bear because i have grumpy bear plush so we have grumpy bear on that side that is the same pattern that i was saying is on my tights and on my bag um because it's also i'm pretty sure if i remember rightly it's been october since i last seen them but that pattern should be on the shoes too on the side there cheer bear there and oh who's the purple bear I forget, I don't have the purple plush. Um, ooh, rainbow and, ooh, that's nice. That's a nice aesthetic. Um, right then, so, I have quite a few pairs of a regular choice now. I have heels, big heels, small heels, um, and I have a pair of the flats, the dolly shoes. I've never had any of the trainers. I chose trainers, because I've never had any of the trainers, and these looked amazing and i thought i'm going to get a lot more use out of trainers because a lot of my regular choice heels i like to display but i actually want to try and wear these now these trainers are called own to care the color is pink and blue obviously you guys if you know me and i got them in my normal size uh 39 which is a six in the uk and um, when i wear flat shoes i wear a six so we'll see if these fit okay 
So it's a slidey old box. Ooh, look at the, look at that. Oh wow, that's nice. Oh, that's amazing. I love details. I love it when companies just go that extra mile and that is what the regular choice do. I can see the shoes, I can see them. Let me just sort my fringe out a little bit. This stupid wig, it's so shiny. I apologize, but trust me, it's better than my lockdown hair. You can see there the red Care Bears tissue paper. And if I pull this back, Right, I'm gonna pull this out. Oh, wow. Yeah, so all over the shoe is the pattern that's on the tights and the bag. I really tried to go matching. Whoa. Oh, they just get better the more you look at them. Oh, wow. Oh my word, pink fluffiness. Oh. Oh. Right, moment of truth. I am pretty sure these light up I've never had light you up shoes since I was a kid, I don't think. Ready? Oh my god, they light up on both sides. Oh my god. Oh, oh, that's the best thing I've ever seen. Oh, I'm so happy right now. I am so happy right now. Okay, so I'm gonna get the other one out because the other one has a different colored bear on it. gonna move this box to one side right okay so oh my god i am being spoiled a regular choice thank you so much um wow okay i mean if there was ever a pair of shoes that are more me <gasps> okay let us start with the shoe mint green on bottom then we've got the kind of detailing around the front there of the white the purple iridescent which matches the bag then we've got that pattern that i talked about that is all over the shoe or the bag with the rainbow which is also on the bag like i said i really wanted to go matching i was just feeling it and then we've got pink fluffy all over and then the little yellow stars and grumpy bear and i've forgotten the name of the green bear and then pink iridescent laces wow i am pretty sure that the bears are, re are removable. Yes, they are, okay. As far as I can tell, the stars are not removable. He seems to be stitched onto the tongue. Now, if you were really bothered, you could snip him off, but why would you do that? Um, and then the bear, he is removable. He is just on the lace there. So hopefully you can see that. So he's stitched and he's on the lace. So you can take the bears off. And they have button noses too, just like the plushies. <gasps> the detailing on these is crazy. So, and then you've got the blue iridescent and the scallop edge there. Oh, wow, look at that. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, just unreal, amazing, fantastic. Do you just wanna put my foot in to see if they are the right size and they are true to size so I can tell you now um, because I'm gonna record the trying on of everything separate. So very well padded. Put the laces up the top so you unhook them. And then the eye holes there. Even on the tongue there, you've got that pattern. That's an ice cream man going past. And then completely the pattern inside as well. Wow, wow. Okay, I'm gonna get my foot in here. So I'm a size six, I got a size six, and 100% these fit. They're not too small, they're not too big. Let me just stand up. I wouldn't say they're as roomy as my usual size six shoes, but the I would say like my toes like here. So they're not big fitting size sixes, they are just. So if you're a big size six or a six and a half, definitely size up. But if you're a six or a five and a half, the six should be fine. So these just fit me because I'm a five in heels and a six in flats. So these just fit me, like they'll be absolutely fine once I get them. Um, the ankle support to keep my foot back, absolutely perfect. <laughs> oh, they look so cute on. Oh, oh my god. It's really hard to show you. I'm gonna do close-ups, but like, oh, I mean, I mean, look. Oh my god, these are the cutest things ever. I'm so happy right now. Right, I need to calm myself down. I have confused myself. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've confused myself. Now I remember. 
Okay, begging your pardon. Okay, so there is kimonos in this collection, but I decided, I've just remembered, like I said, this was October when they approached me and asked me to choose the pieces. I couldn't decide between a kimono or a scarf. And in the end, I went for the scarf because I thought I would get more use out of the scarf. It's a colourful, bright scarf that I can use in the summer. And you can also wrap it around you as a bit of a, um, oh, what's those words? Pashmina, no, not pashmina. You know, like a bit of a shoulder cover and stuff in the summer. Um, and you can also use it as a scarf in the winter. So in the end, I decided to go for the scarf because I thought I'd get more use out of it than the kimonos. But the, kim the kimonos seriously were so beautiful, so check them out. So this is actually a scarf. I've just remembered when I've gotten it out. So that is what it looks like when it's fully out. The big bear at the side and the little bears. And then we've got sunshine bear and cheer bear. 100% polyester it says for this. Um, yeah, Care Bears and all that jazz. Oh, I mean, I'm good. I know I have a wig on, so it's a bit hard, but if you kind of section, oh, I don't know if I can kind of show you like this. Mm, oh, I haven't done it right, but you kind of have it like that. And then you have like a big scarf in the winter. Does that make sense? Anyway, that was why I got it. I remember now. A beach cover up, throng, lots of things. So that was why I went for the scarf. I just thought I'd get more use out of it than a kimono. Um, I feel like kimonos I might only wear on holiday. So that was everything that I was gifted from A Regular Choice. I just want to say again right now, thank you so much A Regular Choice. Um, I've now tried it all on and everything fits perfect. The shoes fit perfect, really comfy. I love the light up. Shoes, so nostalgic. Back to being a kid. Need that in my life every day with the matching bag and oh, it just doesn't it make you just want to like go to comic con and just dress up like a kawaii powder puff princess and yeah i miss the days darn you lockdown but never mind it's for the best um but yeah thank you so much your regular choice i absolutely love everything i'm gonna get so much use out of it all um, the scarf I'm going to use all year round. The bag is my new everyday bag. I am taking that bad boy to work. Those trainers I'm going to wear to work. I kid you not. Um, and the tights as well. I will probably get a bit of use out of them on colder kind of spring summer days. And then come winter and things I'll definitely be wearing them with cute dresses. Um, yeah. I absolutely adore. The, like everything they gifted me was so kind of them right from the start back in October when they were designing the stuff and they sent me over the deck and they asked me what I wanted it was like I don't know who you, who you guys think I am but I'm gonna go with it and thank you so much <laughs> so seriously your record choice you have made my 2020 seriously you have um because let's be honest this year has been a bit crappy for us all so thank you so much regular choice for sending me that over massive thank you to you guys because without you guys I can't do stuff like this um, and I realised, like I said, I haven't posted in a while, but hopefully that was a little bit of a pick me up and it was nice to see you guys and talk to you guys again. I have, I have really missed this. So hopefully that was a nice little catch up for you guys too. I will try my best to try and upload as much as I can. But like I said, my situation is a little crazy and I will, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not stopping. You might just find that maybe towards the end of the year when lockdown's over and I'm in my own place, suddenly I start posting again like crazy and I'm like, right, I'm back. <laughs> so I'm not going anywhere, please just bear with me. And yeah, hope you enjoyed today's video. Go check out A Regular Choice. Their Care Bears collection is out today, Friday the 26th of June, 12 p.m. Um, I know that they do like those waiting things on their website uh, to make it fair for everyone. So get in that queue um, and just, yeah, their stuff is just it's really great quality unique i've never had a problem with anything from them like the quality of the things and um, like how they wear um yeah like i i can't recommend them enough to be honest so yes Ho hopefully that was helpful hopefully that was just a nice thing for you guys to watch um i know there's been a bit of a lack of content on my channel so anyway yeah i'm gonna stop rambling hope you guys all have a lovely day subscribe to my youtube channel Hit the bell notification button for when I do actually upload, you'll be notified. And yeah, thank you so much to you, thank you to A Regular Choice, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. <laughs> that was supposed to take photo.